Get going, ladies and gentlemen. All right, linking the stream to all the social media. Hope you guys are ready for some action. All right. Got it. <laughs> it never gets old, does it? Ping. Ping. <laughs> Look at that angry hawk. Look at him. Look at him crying. That poor sucker. Oh, we have a lot to talk about. Here we go. What's up, friends of the good mood? It's Manny, and welcome back to the next Warabots live stream here with the with the big update. Update 6.A is out for Warobots, and I've designed a hangar with testing everything. Testing the new weaker Scorpion, testing the new weaker Hawk, testing the new buffed Hussars, the new weaker Shredders, the new weaker Atomizers, and so on, right? Uh, but first, let me just take a two minutes tour through the update with you really quickly, just summarizing very quickly what's in there. Luna, you, uh, Luna New Year event, boom. New robot Demeter, I don't have it yet on the Battle Rack account, cannot yet make a video coming coming within the next days, okay? Um, then uh, new special editions of Tiger Scatter and Warrior Typhon, okay? Uh, Hornet and Magnetar, the two new weapons. I, two days ago I made a video with those, so go ahead, check out the video from two days ago, you see what they're about. But there will, of course, be a Mark II video coming. Legendary pilot for uh, Typhon and Demeter. I, I'd like to see what the Typhon one does. Anyways, um, boom boom boom, that's all finished. Report system is in the game now, hopefully people don't screw with that. Um, when they see, look who's talking. And then we have the balancing changes, and that's the big one. The reason why, you see here, there's a very, very, very sad hawk. Man, he's angry, he's sad, and he's crying, okay? And why is that? Because the Hawk is now officially more like an Aochun. Um, you get the resistance, the reflector activates only when you fl start flying and reach high altitude, and it deactivates already as you start to land, not when you land. So you have four seconds or so less resistance on the Hawk, and you can be hit more often, more vulnerable time, okay? And then you do only 50% of the damage with a laser beam against regular robots. You still do the 100% versus Titans, but not against robots. And this is how it has should have been from the beginning. If that's what I've been told, saying from the beginning, it should be good versus Titans, that's what it was supposed to do, but not versus everybody. I still wish they would reduce the uh, resistance bypass. Nightingale change, okay, we're not testing this now, but it flies now higher. Shouldn't be able to capture beacons, which for me is a relief. I hated that about the Nightingales. I know some of you don't. Um, so, um, and uh, yeah, it's flying a bit slower as well, but it has a bigger repair zone. Scorpion, less resistance now, 35% instead of 50%. And the ability duration, four seconds less. That's also a big change. Uh, then we have Atomizer, Nuclear and Quarker. Uh, fi uh, what is that? 50% less damage. Is that right? 50%? 25? 50? I don't know. Shredder, a little bit less damage here and longer reload. Um, Nemesis buff, we're gonna figure this out sometime soon. Mender 2. And here's the thing that I want to show you. Invader, Jaeger, Raker, Rhino, Haichi. We're not testing those, but we're testing Marquez and Huzar. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, Huzar. Huzar, 10% more damage. That we're, we're testing this. Ember and Blaze, we're testing 10% here. Uh, Arbalis is coming up in a separate video. Shock Train, hopefully they fix the problem with not hitting Hawks, right? Uh, Halo Corona Glory effect is better. Uh, and uh, yeah, a couple of bucks fixed. So, we're jumping into the battle. The boosters are running. The, t the, the motivation is there. So let's go have some fun and take a look at what's going on in the donations tab. Holy smokes. We have Owen, Macro um, Owen McCohen with a $20 super chat. Hey, Manny, what's up? What's up, Owen, man? Hey, thank you so much. 20 bucks. The stream has just begun. We have Anime Freak LF. No, Lift Life. Um, a, 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 who became a member. We have Engman Play, who had to become a member again somehow. I read your comment, Engman Plays, before in the stream chat. You said you had to change. Something must have gone wrong there. You had to renew it. No problem, buddy. So uh, thanks for renewing it, by the way. And uh, yeah, so yeah, let's go and have some fun. Uh, match. We, we found a match. That's good. All right. And we're starting with the Hawk. Okay. The biggest change immediately. Starting with the Hawk doing, what are we picking? Uh, let's do a suppression thingy or something, okay? A mix drone. So, 
Now, you see, when we press the, the ability button now, we will no longer immediately trigger our resistance. Now, the resistance will trigger um, only after we reach the highest altitude. And the same goes for the landing, too. And now, we do, however, do 10% more damage on the flames, right? Those flames are supposed to do 10% more damage now, but they're still 100% hard to aim. <laughs> you do 10% more damage, but it's 100% harder to aim. Look, it's barely- I'm barely able to, to hit anything here. So, here comes, uh, an enemy. Okay, I'm starting to fly now, and you see, only now is the resistance actually triggered. Only after- hold on, let's go for the, uh, for the leech here first. And, uh-oh, we have two guys coming for us. But the thing is, one thing that this guy apparently didn't seem to understand right is that I have the flamethrowers. Alright. Uh, this guy is jumping. Okay, he's coming, and he's got the explosion rocking. Man, I am in a bit of in trouble here. But... We grilled him. So the damage output on the flamers, uh, Ember Blaze, great damage output. The the only problem is you have to somehow make a hit. You have to somehow hit the enemy, and that's that's the big problem. Okay, he's uh, he's out doing his thing. All right, uh, let's. Uh, I know what he's gonna try and do. He's gonna try and add corrosion to us, which is not a problem at first. But as soon as we land and the corrosion still takes, that's when we take real damage. Alright, so, let's creep our way forward here. Okay. Uh, he's got the ability probably ready, I would assume. Oh, look at that guy. Uh, he's coming for us already. Yeah, he's jumping. Okay. Uh, I'm starting to phase shift. And I'm going, going for... This dude first. Oh, he's got the stealth thing. He had the stealth unit, did you see that? Uh-oh. Oh, man. He's already on me again. That's quick. Oh, no. There's more. <laughs> there's more than one. All right. That that explains it. All right. So, that was one thing that we needed to test. Let's test the... Um... Yeah, let's test the Typhon. Let's test the Typhon here. The sniper version of Ty uh, uh, with with the Hussars. And we have a lot of range. And... Um... Okay, the lockdown hasn't worked, even though I did activate the lockdown hit. Uh, this guy? Boom, boom. Alright, he's face shifting. Is he gonna try and get for another ability run? Well, it's not gonna work this time. I got him. Alright. And we have a Nightingale on us. So the damage output should be really good on this. Uh-oh. Oh yeah, the Inquisitor was also buffed. That's right. Let's check out around the corner. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. I got him. I got him locked as well. Did you see that? I I got both of them pretty much. All right, one more shot. Oh, come on. Oh, he's still alive. I can't believe it. He's still alive. I switched the target too soon. Now he gets to heal himself. All right, maybe we can get that TC guy before he uses his shield ability. Yep. I think he can't activate his shield right now. No, he can. Huh? How did you activate your shield when I hit you with this? Whoa, that's weird. You saw me hitting him with the ability, right? But this time I get him. Maybe he had anti-control or something. I don't know. Could be. But the damage output and we don't even have overdrive running is actually pretty good. Three hits and this guy's done. Come on, get killed. Okay, I hit him here. I suppressed him. Problem is, though, that the suppression doesn't last forever. And now Overdrive is running. At least for a few seconds. Uh oh, they the enemy has a Titan now. They have a Titan. Oh man, he's doing damage. Woo! But I also- Whoa, look how much damage I did to him, too. Wow. That's pretty crazy, man. That was- that was quite a lot of damage here. Uh... Uh-oh. Ooh, that is a lot of damage that I just took. Oof. Yup. Don't mess with those Aochons. 
Uh oh, and there comes a hawk. I was able to suppress him, I think, so I'm okay at the moment. Let's kill him. Be oh, he activates phase shift now. He knows he would die. He knows he would die if he uh, if he lands, right? Uh, because now he's vulnerable during the landing, so he starts the phase shift immediately uh, as he uh, yo comes down a little from the landing. Okay. Wow, that is a lot of titans. There is titans no matter where I look. And right now, I don't want to spawn my titan. I just want to keep doing what I'm doing. Let's go for him. Here, maximum damage as we can. Boom, boom. Boom. And uh, we didn't get him because we also take a few, took a few hits from the titans to our left. Uh, but, um... So let's go a fly above him. And I'm done already because he had the shotguns and you die like in two seconds from the shotguns But maybe we can spawn here at this guy It probably wasn't the best choice to spawn in the Titan right in front of those shotgun Arthurs But we still have something we can test which is uh, Yeah, let's go with um, With this thing The effect accumulation is supposed to be slower on shredders now, but you see the reload is longer, right? You see, the, the reload is way longer now. I just got... I, I think he just suppressed me, yeah. He's gonna have to reload now, anytime, any moment. And that is a long reload of 12 seconds, isn't it? Oh man, that reload sucks, does it? I know, I know, that reload is really bad. And he does the suppression again. Okay. Whoa, I got pushed back. Uh, the thing is though, I... Whoa, how fast is this Blitz? Has it always been this fast during the ability? How fast is this Arthur? What? Do you see that? Am I crazy? Is this guy that just ran way faster than he should? This guy was way faster than he should be. All right, anyways. Match is over anyway, so... That was just a showcase of all the things. Yeah. <clears throat> Alright, so, first match is over. Um, my team didn't stand the slightest chance right there, but that's not about winning, it's about showing the new things. And I believe that the Hussars do really well, uh, but uh, not as good as the uh, the Titans. Like, when you run around with a shotgun Titan for such a long time as he did, then of course you get faster. Uh, we had Vomit AA Sausage with a three pound donation. His royal m um, moistness is here. Moistness, huh? <laughs> hey, man. Uh, Finn Versteg with three, uh, 2.3 euros. Hey, Manny, he says. Hey, man. How is it? Uh, Connor Scrivener has become a mem member as well. Nice. Thank you guys for the donations and for becoming members. I really appreciate it. So, let's test. Uh, let's go into next match immediately and start testing away. We have a lot to test here, guys. But, um, let's talk about the Hawk, okay? The Hawk nerf. That's- I have been saying this for a couple of weeks, months even, that the Hawk should be like the Aochun, and it should only get its resistance when it's in the air- up in the air and lose it as soon as it starts landing. I've said this the whole time, and, um, I knew it was probably gonna come at some point. I don't know why they waited so long with it, though. So, let's go with, uh, with the Nucleon, uh, Ravana now, okay? We have it with um, uh, with jump unit this time, and we have the uh, module booster, the damage boost when we run the module. All right, whoop! There we go. We're doing more damage now. Yeah, he's jumping away. Like he he saw me coming and he immediately books it. <laughs> what the heck, Navi Jod? What is wrong, man? He's booking it instantly. What the heck? Why did he do that? Let's go for him. Woo! This is cool, man. The jump on on the hawk uh, on the ra uh, the thing is cool. And also, I, I I trigger I trigger the added damage every time I jump. I also get more damage output, right? The only problem is I do not have uh, the thing. 
Okay, let's make the hawk fly. Uh, oh. Up. <laughs> Bye. Oh, hey, he's still on me. Trying to get his last stand to activate, but uh, man, that's not so easy. And then maybe finishing him off. Nope. Um, there we go. Yep. Oh, the five seconds of reload is pretty crazy, man. Yo, those five seconds really make a difference. I cannot face shift, otherwise he's gonna capture the beacon, which is a problem. Yeah, okay. Uh, oh, wow, wow. <laughs> How many? How many I had on me? It's unreal. It's like they see money gaming and the entire map jumps on that location, dude. Seriously. What the heck? All right, here, boom, boom. Lockdown instantly. He, of course, immediately activates the shield because, of course, the shield was ready, right? Couldn't have been that the shield is just not ready. No, the shield has to be ready. But now he's taking damage. Uh, I'm taking quite a bit of laser damage. Boom, one shot, one kill. Oh, man, turns out I was unable to hit the dude with, um... With my ability and a friendly shield has blocked it. That was crazy. All right, he's face shifting now. Okay, I think nope. I couldn't deactivate his ability because he actually has a uh, anti control. Okay. All right. So. Boom! 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 Boom, boom. Let's finish him off. Then this guy too. Bam, bam. Nice. That's how we do it in the money town. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for the block. Thanks for the awesome blocking. Yes. I was walking backwards the whole time. Uh, and that's exactly why. I expected that a, a scorpion or something would jump on me immediately. And uh, exactly that happened. Now damage output. Come on. Boom. With the added damage, that should be a, a thing. Yes, we did it. All right, he's not gonna jump anytime any soon. Uh, anytime soon. Woo! Man, it feels like I'm getting jumped on a lot by hawks and by everything right now. I can hit him. Yep, I'm hitting him. Despite me not being able to actually see him, I am still hitting the guy. Look. I killed him. <laughs> I wasn't even able to see the guy, but I was still able to kill him there uh, with uh, just generally shooting into his direction. Oh god, another titan back on the battlefield. Yep, did some damage there. Boom, boom, boom. I like the setup, man. I like the sound. I like the looks. I think it's overall pretty great. Now he's on me, dude. Now he's really on me. But the hawk is getting destroyed, I believe. Yep. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, right in the back. A nice back rub. Nice back massage. Yeah. I wonder if I have the right drone equipped. Do I get um, the damage boost when I activate my my ability here? My last stand? No, my, my lockdown ammo? No, I don't. I don't have the right drone equipped. That's why I'm not getting the damage boost. I thought the whole time I was getting the damage boost when I uh, used my my thing. I must have swapped the, the wrong drone. Woo! Oh, wow. 1,435 people right there. Thank you guys for tuning in. That's cool. Really nice. Glad to have you here. Oh, man. I just hit him with the ability, but of course he gets to... Uh, Boom, got him. Boom, 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 boom. Lockdown ammo. Then let's catch him this time. Now you're not going anywhere, son. You're not going anywhere. Not this time. Gotcha! 
Sorry for the low donation. I'm just a poor kudos, Manny, from the Philippines. Why would you apologize for a low donation? You don't have to donate at all, my friend. It's all optional, completely. And if you just send a buck or whatever, why not? You know, that's cool. I wouldn't complain about this. Seriously, man. You're cool. Thank you. Thank you for every little bit. I mean, it's cool. Uh, oh, he's looking at me. Well, it will take me, like, forever to, uh, to drop him. But I can shoot past him and hit this guy instead. Bam, ba, 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 de, ba, dee, 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 Uh, yo. We're, we're having this battle in the back, dudes. Boom. Okay. I'm gonna get killed again really quickly, I think, but... You know, at least I should have, uh, a bit of a... A few seconds of time to do some damage. Boom. I think we just went through them like a hot knife through butter, dude. What is that? What is that? Boom. <laughs> dude, these rocket launchers are so sick. Bam. There he's already done. Since when does the Aochun fly that high? Look. When could you ever start flying and then land on this building? Immediately. That's unusual, isn't it? I feel like I've never been able to do that before. <laughs> he's, he's doing his best to try to try stay alive. There's no way, man. Hi, everyone. How's it going? Jat, um, Jati the Gas. Hey man, Greg, Greg Gamer, Engman Plays, you guys in the stream chat, Connor Stevener, who just became a member and can now write in the stream in the stream chat. By the way, as usual, second second half of the stream is with uh, members, everybody's chatting, okay? First hour of the stream, members only, second hour, open for everyone. So this time, I'm gonna collect the, I'm gonna choose the right drone, okay? Uh, let's go with Team Deathmatch. Let's go with Team Deathmatch once, less progressive game mode, but, um, yeah. I just joined. What's the nerf added to the hawk? A uh, mech anim uh, animal caught M. Um, yo, uh, so what's the nerf added to the hawk? The nerf is that you you only deal 50% of the the damage you do you usually did with a laser beam. Only 50% of that you now do to robots. You still do 100% against titans, but only half the damage against robots. And that's why the hawk in my thumbnail looks like this. The second part of the nerf looks a little different. Um, it makes it so that uh, you have... Um, oh, that's team deathmatch, that's right. The second part is that your res resistance on the hawk only activates when you reach the highest point of your flight and deactivates already as you start to descend. These two things are the nerf. So, let's go and... This time I chose the right drone. This time we're gonna be able to do triple damage. Boom, 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 boom. Look at this. Look at that guy! He already lost a weapon! Yo, this is money gaming, is it? <laughs> Yo, dude, this guy already lost a weapon after three shots. Ah, that's a scorpion right there, look. He would like to... Oh, hello. Oh, let's get him. Let's get him locked. He's locked and suppressed, and as he falls... I can already yield here. See that? Full damage on him. His resistance is already gone uh, because that's the nerf. He doesn't keep his resistance. Ah, dang it. Okay, I wanted to get, catch him before he starts using that. You know what? Let's outposition him. If I walk like this, then I will outposition him and then kill him. Boom, 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 boom. That's it. Wait, you're alive? Oh, face shift. That's why. Wreck, rank man. Rank man, get wrecked, man. That's right. You did a good job, Violator. <laughs> well, what's with the names? Rank man and the Violator. <laughs> oh, man. Dude, you just violated that guy. All right, so <laughs> what's with the names, man? I really, it's crazy. It's really crazy. All right, I think, uh, what is that? What is that? Boom, it's death. That's what it is. Before they can re even react, they're already dead. Bam! Of course, thanks to the lag, I missed my uh, my my shot right there. That's uh, uh oh, that's dangerous. I don't want to get hit by uh, by his. Oh, hello. Oh yeah, that's right. He can't suppress me. And double damage now activated. Bam! 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 Oh man, those hussars, they hurt. They really hurt. 
He's not teleporting back. Phew! This time I got him. But I can't really hit him very well. And by the way... Oh my god, I can't move back! He's gonna jump on me as soon. Or no, he's not. Okay, let's deactivate his ability. Nice! No, he had anti-control! Dude, li I'm not even joking. Liter literally every time I do manage to connect my ability to somebody, they have anti-control. Every single time. I never I never get to actually delete or disable somebody's ability and then kill them because they always have anti-control. It's completely crazy. All right, here we go. Nope, nope, nope. He activated it. He got it. He got his ability out in time. He got the ability out in time and I did not connect my my deactivating ability. The, the ability that deactivates his ability. Alright, that's pretty dangerous right here. I should probably retreat a little. Because uh, a tank and a Ravana, that's like double tanking action. But we are three guys. We should be able to take him on, right? Should be able to take him on. This time I got him. Now his ability is deactivated. And boosh! That's how we do it! Double kill! Hello! Oh wow, there's somebody else. Bam, bam. It's an Hades. Of course he gets his shield out. Rank man! <laughs> Where did you leave your friend the Violator? Bam, bam, bam! Yo, I couldn't suppress him. Uh, lock him, I mean. Inquisitor is jumping. But he's jumping at very far range. I need to drop my overdrive anyhow, so... Yeah. The crazy thing is, if he comes out with a shield, and I do it right, I'll be able to hammer in massive damage on the Fenrir. Wow, I'm getting hit a lot now. Oh, hold on, target. So, I'm waiting for him to make a mistake, but he's not making it. He's not making the- Oh, now he makes that mistake! Oh, I couldn't do it. I was trying to hit him with the ability, so that he cannot activate his resistance again. But that didn't work. I fired my charge a little bit too soon. But you saw what I did to him, right? Yep. Rank man, sorry buddy. You don't stand a chance here. Bam, 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 bam. Down to last stand with him instantly. Okay, that didn't hit. I really like that sniper build, but we're also gonna test the other the other web uh, the other setups in the next next match. Okay, so he's corner shooting now. That's cool. Go ahead, do that. Bam, bam, bam. Got him down in two shots or three. All right. He's behind the corner. Okay, I'm taking now I'm taking damage. Overdrive is finally activating. Can you believe it? After such a long time, overdrive actually finally activated. We can finally do triple damage here. Alright, I'm hitting, I'm hitting. Even though he's in the ability. And he just used his ability, so he doesn't have it now. Again, I hit him with my ability, and yet he somehow... He somehow managed to activate his ability too. You saw this, right? It's so buggy, man. Seriously, this is so buggy. Got him. Okay, I'm still getting corner shot by, um... By the other dudes, but now that overdrive is active, I can go into safe distance. And just, uh, regenerate my firepower. And then come in in 5 seconds and do 300% damage against him. Okay? 300% now. Boom, 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 boom. Look at this. Look at that damage. Holy moly. That was out of control. I just sniped the entire Titan down into in a few seconds. Why is he still hitting me? Okay. Alright. Got him. And now 300% weapon damage. Bam, 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 bam. 
Wow, this guy has a very well leveled, uh, our ma uh, um, what's it called? Uh, Nodens. Very well leveled. He's barely taking any damage. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Corner shooting a little. Ah, I couldn't hit him. Get yeah, 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 yeah. Ouch, there goes the first weapon. But you know what? Let's do something real quick. Hi. Wow, he immediately turns to me. He immediately turned to me. Whoa. He must have absolutely known that I was going to do that now. Also, this must be a level 100 max uh, um, Arthur here. You see this? He's taking very little damage from my rockets, even though they're fully maxed with maximum damage on uh, on the modules too. Yeah, dude, I'm gonna. I'm sorry to tell you, but you're losing this battle big time, because my rockets just annihilate the heck out of you. <laughs> yep. All right, here he comes. He's in range now. Starting to reel. We have one and a half minutes left to have some heavy fun. And by the way, this guy, he just had a suppression. All right, boom. Wow. How did I take this much damage? Whoa, I don't understand. Okay, but here is uh, something fun. I don't understand what did that much damage to me right there. Alright. Flamers coming in. The lags are so insane, man. So crazy. Alright, I'm hitting him pretty hard. Alright, starting to fly. He suppresses me, but he can't because Kyle Rogers does not get suppressed. And now he's done. And he's gonna jump on me now. Yep, there it is. We all knew that was gonna happen because it's a scorp uh, scorpion. It's what it what they do. But that's good. We're we're winning this match anyhow. So, damn. Uh, next uh, match, we're definitely gonna test this thing with a drone, okay? Because I wanna run uh, this robot here with the with the drone that does the increased damage, right? Every time we fire. Uh, or every time we uh, we jump, we get added damage boost. That's what I want to do. And whoa, we have a couple of donations coming in here. Mohammed Dash uh, Drashat with five dollars for the best. Thank you, Mohammed. Um, we have Rami G H Bat with uh, thirty-five GTQ. Hey, money. So now we have to wait one year at la at least to buy the new robots. So I started to ha hate war robots after playing for four, four years. What do you mean with you have to wait for one year? before you can buy the robot. You mean the Demeter? Has something changed? Are they not ma being made available in the next box openings? And um, because usually in these box openings, those you no, no, new robots, I have always gotten them when I opened a couple of boxes, but usually I also, you know, I opened a lot of them, but I never really didn't get a robot. But is that what you mean? Or, or are you meaning like directly buying them specifically in offers? I'm not sure. WTX Gaming with a $2 super chat. Ich mach mal uh, mein... Ich mach bald mein Arschein. Cool. Uh, he's, he's saying he's making his um, his A, a, a license for paramotor flying. Uh, a license is the um, the one for uh, just flying the the, uh, the paraglider, basically. Or am I mistaking something right now? Is B... No, B is the one with overland, where you can fly long distance on the paramotor. And A is basically just, I think, pilot for glide... Uh, show, uh, uh, you know, uh, will I really am two pound? Uh, it's not a nerf. It's a rebalance. Therefore fair in this case. I agree uh, will I really am I really uh, agree in this case uh, I have been wanting that change for a long time and overall I gotta say Pixonic nailed it on this one even though I know there will be some people who are gonna be mad There's oh you can never make it perfect for everybody, but in this case I think Pixonic nailed it the nucleons right uh, the the Hawk, the Scorpion, the Nightingale capturing of in-flight stealth. Um, all this 
in my opinion, correct. The only thing, the only thing I correct, or I would do differently, is I would like to see Havoc, Scatter, and, um... Uh, and Devastator also in the in the nerf loop because they really need a nerf and here I have a suggestion I have a big a, a cool suggestion for how you could nerf. Oh, by the way. Whoa blue is Andrade again with the f 150 Mexican dollars. I think hey Manny. Hi, uh, hey here again. Let's go. I'm late. Hope the stream is going amazing You're the best youtuber ever Luis Andrade you again with those 150s dude <laughs> you're, the, you're the man. Thank you so much and welcome back. We also had pretty uh, short Harry. No, pre pretty chowd Harry with 50 pounds. Worst nightmare of Arthur Flames Hawks should I have? Uh, sh uh, should have. That's right. Uh, the 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 flamer on the hawk is like the worst thing that can happen to um to a to an, an Arthur. It's crazy how fast you run through those. Then we have Mech Animals uh, caught M. Uh, no, I've already read this. Okay. All right, uh, I mean because it got nerfed, uh, Rani GH butt. Yeah, I mean, it, it is a nerf. Oh, wow. Hold on, I got a hit. Um... Ooh, I'm taking a lot of damage here. I'm taking quite a lot of damage. Uh, let's get this guy out of the way. Wow, did I suffer a lot of damage. Ooh. But the good thing is... Oh, that's a Daymater. There's a Demeter always already in my team. That is so awesome, dude. Jack, you are the man. All right, let's go up here and jump. And then kill whatever this is. Haichi. Who double dashes, of course, to make my abilities uh, worthless. And then I'm locked, ag locked again. I can corner shoot here. That's very good. And I have Jack still with me. Doing the old uh, support around. Nice. Jack, you're cool, man. The only problem I have is that the guy can corner shoot me here. But look at this position. Look how sick this is. I can just corner shoot them down. We're putting such pressure on the enemy. It's crazy. With double damage now against the, the, the bulwark. Because I activated the double damage. Alright, this guy... All right, I have to uh, get out of this if possible. Oh, no, I'm dead now. All right, but we did quite a lot of pressure at the enemy here. Uh, let's do the flamer. No, wait, let's keep the flamer hawk till the end. Let's start with the scorpion this time. We haven't really ran the scorpion yet. Um, that's the first time I'm taking it. And um, I have a suggestion, guys, for, uh, for how they could balance the scatter, havoc, and uh, the devastator. And I think it's the perfect solution. Like, really. Uh, like, literally the perfect solution. I'll, I'll, I'll say it as soon as I have time to concentrate. Alright, finishing him off despite leech ability. Oh, wow, the hawk just landed. Hello, hockey boy. Oh, wow, is that a long stealth? Jesus Christ! That was seven seconds of stealth. Did you see that, man? And he's got another one. All right, this guy. Okay, he's got his resistance down now. I'm having overdrive now finally active. Okay. Hawk is there. Got him. Jumping on this guy. Anchor man. The anchor man. Hello, anchor man. Got him down to last stand. Uh-oh, you know what? I It seems like I need some time to regenerate my firepower here. Oh, everyone is on me. That's what you get if you raid the enemy spawn, man. <laughs> that, that's what you get what you get for spawn raiding the enemy like that. That is nothing you should you should never do this in, especially not in team deathmatch, like where they can only spawn right there. Finn Versteak. Good luck pronounce my name again. Finn, I think this is maybe a a, a, a Dutch name. Holland Hollandischer name. Name. Um Finn Versteak. Finn Versteak. 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 I don't know. <laughs> One of them hopefully was it. I don't know, dude. Johnny became an, uh, a member. Also, thank you, Johnny, for joining in. Johnny, be good. Uh, who's our MS? Hey, Manny, schön dich wiederzusehen. Hey, thank you. You guys are way too nice to me, really. Uh, well, how do I... Oh! 
Can they, can they actually spawn somewhere else now? That was unexpected. Aha, there you are. <laughs> that teleport back did not help you, my friend. But you see, we're doing a lot less damage to the enemy now uh, compared to before. All right, am I getting in? Yes! Or, well, I didn't get the kill, but I almost got it. That was cool. So, the flamethrowers. Yeah, the off there's the author. And my, my last stand is already active. Look, last stand is already active, and there is the Arthur. Oh, I already deleted half the Arthur. Oh! <laughs> that guy is going down. He's going down so fast. Look, his shooters are also gone. Oh, this is, uh, this is so bad. If you get like this, this is the worst thing that can happen to you. If you get attacked by a, a hawk like this. My goodness. Another... Oh, no, that's not an Arthur. Could you guys please spawn your Arthurs? That would be really kind of you. I need more Arthurs to kill. So, suppression on him. Starting to fly. Bam. Starting to do damage. And see, the Titan still takes full 100% damage. Only regular robots now uh, take less damage. They are uh, affected by this, and they only take 50%. Uh, Ouch! Hey, 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 what have I... What have I ever done to you, Atis? Atis, what is it? What did I do to you? Why are you doing this? Why are you bullying me? <laughs> Stupid meme. Why are you bullying me? Where's the Arthur? Is that an Arthur? Yo, this might be an Arthur. Oh, if this is an Arthur... Then I, yeah, this must be an Arthur, because he's not taking damage. Hello, Arthur! Let me show you something! <laughs> Oh, oh, oh man, this is brutal. This is really brutal, dude. This is this is out of control. The, oh man, so much damage. All right, so my secrets or my suggestion for balancing havoc, scatter, and devastator. Okay, one problem I have with these rep, I have two problems with these weapons. They are very overpowered in the game right now. And the oh, by the way, nice match, Jack. And thanks for the support and the healing. Uh, let me show your hangar real quick, just to thank you for the awesomeness. Because I rarely do have somebody really that awesome in my team helping me and supporting me. Level 4 Demeter here, Mark 2. What's that dude? Oh, that's the pilot. It doesn't even have a description yet. Demeter buff. Jerry Fortune Demeter buff. It doesn't even say what it does. <laughs> okay. Alright, so nice, uh, nice, nice hangar and thank you for supporting me. Uh, during the match. That was really cool. Uh, and uh, so, my problem with De Havoc, Devastator, and uh, and Scatter is... A. You have, the, you have the same problem as we used to have with the shotguns, because they offer way too much firepower. They have way too much firepower before they have to reload. And this is the, the old shotgun meta all over the way again. Okay, first problem, too much damage output. Second problem, and, uh, and that's where my idea comes in. Second problem is that they reduce healing to zero. Okay, now let me tell you, let, I need your opinion, ladies and gentlemen, on this. In the video description, may, or this live stream, or in the video description, uh, opin, uh, no, in the comments later down below, okay? I need you guys' opinion. What do you think about my idea? Uh, Pixonic is introducing supporters, right? The, the Mender just got buffed. The Nightingale got a better healing ability. The Demeter got added to the game, and is now a, a new support healer, okay? So, Pixonic is trying to to capitalize on support playstyle, which is awesome. I think that I agree that is amazing. I think we need more supporters in the game and less lone wolf players, okay? And uh, and the thing is, the scatter and havoc with their uh with their ability to, to reduce healing to zero, what they do basically is they make healing and supporting useless. So now a supporter doesn't have any support ability anymore. He's no longer useful because he can't heal you anymore, right? He might still be able to give you a temporary shield for a few seconds or so with a Demeter, okay? But the whole healing aspect is gone. And I am pretty sure even Pixonic at this point is considering what they could do about this. They probably also realized that um, they wanted to do more support, but then realized that the, the, the new weapons kind of contradict the whole thing, right? They kind of uh, ruined that. And, um, yeah. So this guy, he just had his ability. So I just jump him like a boss and kill him real quick. And, uh, and then run out of the way. That's it. My assassin run. 
And uh, my idea or suggestion, instead of reducing healing to zero, what what these weapons should do, they should leave the heal maximum health as it is. You can still heal to the same amount of health as you can with another weapon too. When another weapon has damaged you. All right. What the difference is, um, you heal twice as slow. You now need twice as much healing, right? So instead of reducing maximum HP, they, sh they should leave maximum HP as it is. But when you get hit by Scatter or Devastator or Havoc, you can no longer heal yourself with a full healing power. You need twice as much healing to get full filled up. This would mean that the Scatter, Havoc, and Devastator still keep their effect of um, making, um, you know, he like having an effect on healing. They would still get to keep that function or functionality, while at the same time, supporter playstyle is reinforced. Supporters are more relevant even because of this, right? I have a hawk on me too. It's crazy. Um, so because now you need more amount of healing to get full to get heal healed all the way, and therefore you are in even more of a need to get a nice healer. All right, got him with the jump. I can't believe I'm still alive, by the way. But no more. But I did a lot here. I think I, I really did a lot here with the setup. Um, so what do you think about this suggestion? Because I think it's, it, it, it would be literally be a win-win for for uh, for everything. Uh, healers are still going to be healers. They're still going to be able to do their thing. And even more so than before, because now there is a real need for healers, as there is more healing power needed. And uh, and secondly, the weapons keep their their designated, uh, you know, uh, you know, purpose. What purpose they had, they keep. You know what? I want to kill this guy now. This guy has been on getting go, getting on my nerves for so long now. Wow, am I taking a lot of damage? Crazy. Here, I almost killed the hawk right there, in his before he reached his altitude. We need to suppress. This blitz here, and this guy as well, which we did. We just suppressed all of them, and now I'm getting killed. Ugh. I'm always too aggressive. I'm t I'm playing way too aggressive here, uh, and I'm I'm doing it again. I can't stop. I can't stop myself. Boom, boom, boom. And uh, by the way, if you did that right, the passive the passive healing. From um, from from your pi pilot, the passive healing skill from your pilot, it would still be effective. So also your also immense amounts of gold spent in healing, uh, healing powers are not useless now. They will work, but they're just you know only half as effective. That's the big difference now. They're only half as effective, and you need some healers. By the way, what am I doing to these guys? I'm just running through, killing everything left and right. Okay. Ah, I couldn't fire at him one more time. I needed to shoot him just once before he starts flying. Alright, let's ignore his resistance there. Yep, we are ignoring his resistance alright, but the thing is, he's got just a lot of HP. I'm already killed again! What is going on with my with my with my Titans these days, dude? Yo, dude, I'm down. My, I, I'm losing this. This is a full. Is this not a fully maxed Titan? Oh, I'm not using the maxed Ao Ming. Oh! I'm using a low level Ao Ming, and I'm like, why am I dying so fast all the time? What has happened? Now I know. I entered idiot mode, and I, <laughs> I something did. I did something wrong during uh. All right, all right, I got it. Oh, man. Bam, got him. And finished him off, nice. I deactivated his ability right there because I first dropped his shield. That's why I kept dying so fast. I didn't understand why I went down always so freaking fast. Now I know. I have a freaking level 48 Ao Ming in the lineup. Ugh. All right, so Vin Verstake, it said, yeah, it's Dutch. And you did say it almost correct. I'm glad to hear that, my friend. Thank you. Uh, that is good to know. Is he gonna fly? 
When he's gonna fly, we can kill him. No, wait, it's a Nightingale. Ah, uh, but we were still able to kill him. Alright, I locked everybody down. Whoa, we have three Titans in front of us. And, um, and I'm having uh, <laughs> my Titan just wasted. Uh, hello, I see. So, uh, what people say? Ich bin cool. Okay. Uh, hold on. Oh, God. Bop, bop. Added damage rolling. I'm walking back into a distance here. Getting back in cover. Actually, I want my overdrive to activate. Yeah, uh, well, get a great stream, Manny Engman plays. Thank you, dude. Uh, look at the Demeter. Okay, nobody said anything about the suggestion I did, I believe. Uh, the suggestion I mentioned, but uh, I can also read it in the in the comments later. Boom, boom, boom. Well, we're running a very weak setup right now, and the enemy is filled with titans. They have all the titans in the gameplay right now. Wow, okay. Instantly dead. Right, I did not account for that guy. But we still have this thing. Alright, let's get him here. Going for... Uh, the Nodens here. Going for the Noodle. The Noodle has to be destroyed. We must destroy the Noodle. How are there this many Titans? How are there this many Titans in our base? What has happened? How did that ever become a thing? Ah! Too many Titans in our base. All right, let me swap the Titan. Now I know why I kept dying so early. Um, WTX, you're the best YouTuber. Thank you so much, man. I'm not sure that's probably not true, but thank you so much. Oh, we were one guy down, and I noticed that. I really noticed that we were, like, getting absolutely pushed by the enemy. So let's swap the, the right um, thing here, okay? Let's, um... I don't know what the heck happened here. Uh, equip, change Titan, and, uh, yeah. That's the one. Right. There it is. So... 100, level 150. Yes, okay. <laughs> yup, that's how, that's how you can, sh you know, screw yourself too. Oh, man. And the thing is, if I had known my Titan is so weak, then I would have played differently, you know? I would have stayed all the way back, and I tried to snipe from a distance. But I didn't know I have this low-level Titan, so I played it as if I had a high-level Titan, and obviously, that was a very bad idea. Um, so, yeah. Oh, man. Alright, let's get going. Try and, uh, what is that? That's a scorpion, yes. Alright, we need to hit the scorpion before it teleports. Alright, let's see if we can do this here. Bam! I don't know what happened there. Did I get him? Uh, that was odd. I don't know. Your maker. Okay, let's uh, try and help over here. I got him suppressed and locked. And he is going down. There it is. The thing is, though, that the enemy might be getting our beacon here. Oh, and I thought for a second that I have a hawk. Whoops. I thought for a second I have a hawk, but the good news is, uh, because I jumped in here, um, I was able to uh, prevent the beacon cap, and this way, uh, you know, they couldn't, uh, my, my buddy was able to respawn here. He was able to respawn because I walked onto the beacon. So this way we were able to not lose the beacon. That was good. That would have sucked if they had gotten this. Alright, I can deactivate his ability in two, one, and bup! His, his ability is now deactivated. He doesn't have it, and he can't do anything about it. Boom. He just wanted to activate it too. He just had his cooldown regenerated, and then I had him 
uh, on a bad position. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. This guy is now leeching. This guy is now landing. This guy is now suppressed. Nope, he's not because he's got anti-control. Again. But I got this guy now, which is good. Okay. Okay, got him down to last stand. And I got him killed. Nice. That would not have happened without the uh, without the weaker hawk now. The hawk has been made weaker, as you know. Okay, I was unable to hit him. And he's got jump unit too. That's crazy. That's a big problem here. But the good news is I got him down to last stand and we have backup from behind. Uh oh, I'm getting hit from behind too. Nice job there, slow. Thank you, man, for not being so slow. <laughs> uh, eh? There's another one of those things. All right, I don't think, no, I was unable to get his uh, ability deactivated. Okay, he's going for our beacon now. And uh, I'm gonna try and not have this guy take our beacon. I can obviously not heal, right? Any of the damage that he does, but I can make sure he's never gonna get that beacon. He's never gonna get that beacon. That's also an enemy here. Boom, I hit him, but I got suppressed, so that's a problem. Now let's get back in cover here. From here we can do a lot of stuff. Okay. Boom. Ignoring 100% of his resistance. Got him. Now, that's a difference. See? That Titan doesn't get destroyed in two seconds. Um, we have enough HP to survive a couple of hits. So they're gonna take our beacon, or they're gonna try to. And I'm gonna try and land here from where I hope I can support. He's coming for me, I think. Yep, the good news is I have the big damage here. The bad news is I'm being aimed at by an Ares. Uh, boom! Oh, I hit him! I hit him with those double shots. Can I kill him? Yep, through the wall. The enemy is pretty powerful here, man, I gotta say. They're pushing pretty hard into our base. But I'm doing the best I can to defend. Boom. Okay, he's got the reflector going. And I knew it. I knew he was gonna come for me now. I knew it. But I should be able to kill him here. Nice. Got him. Boom. Thankfully, that thing doesn't reach me. Oh man, we have a lot of enemies on us. And I've, of course, I've lost a heavy weapon. Of course I don't lose a light weapon. No, I always have to lose a heavy weapon. Why are you hitting me behind the wall here, man? Uh... Yeah, the enemy is incredibly powerful here, dude. Seriously, there's not a single second where I can just breathe breathe, and, and have a, a, a relaxing second. There's nothing, nothing to relax. If I have had at least both heavy weapons still, then I could really do a lot of damage from here, even with my low HP, but the game never allows me to have this. Like, when I'm low HP, I always lose my heavy weapon. So, we're taking the Titan. I don't think I have to actually use my my thing here. Actually, wait a minute. Dude, are you kidding me? What ha- wait. What? 
Why did he not get suppressed sooner? Dude, that was weird. He didn't get suppressed. He should have been suppressed way sooner than that. I had my flamer with all the suppression going on. And he, he didn't get suppressed. Okay. So he is on the beacon with me. And I'm just gonna hold the beacon there. He shook his head as if he's like not going to attack me. Uh, so I'm uh, not going for it either. But um, I can also not allow you to get any further beacons because you guys are already winning as it is in terms of beacon progress. And I guess at least suppressing should I should be to uh, make it harder for you to kill my friends. Yeah, my team is making out, so there's that. All right, so we got a fight apparently. Uh, overdrive isn't yet running. He's on the beacon, but you know what I can do? I can finish this guy off. And then try and run for this beacon here. And try and capture this instead. It's not winning right now, but it's also, it's postponing the lose. That's what it is. We're postponing the losing. All right, I'm taking a lot of damage from him up there. All right. He's getting healed. I'm the only left survi uh, guy surviving uh, left, I think. Yep. All right, I have to heal anyways. I was suppressed, that's why I couldn't kill him. If I hadn't been suppressed, I would have killed him there, no problem. Uh, okay, let's jump into the next robot. Woo! Whoa, that jump, that jump went a little bit further than I wanted. Oh! Oh, it what? This far? Since when does the Ravana jump this far? What the heck? Did you see that? I thought I was gonna jump onto the rocket tower. I didn't think I was gonna launch into the enemy base. What? Aaron Platner here with a $5 super chat. Hey Manny, what's uh, been curious to see the shotguns Ming in some close range action. Is it worth trying? Would you rather not? Um, I think it's okay. I personally think that the rockets are actually the better brawler because you can brawl up to 500 meters range very effectively here. Um, uh, with, uh, with the, bra with the Tsar. I think those are the better brawling weapons. Uh, uh, excuse me, but, um, we can, we can slap them on. Let's just slap on these, uh, Grums and then test them, right? Uh, let's go. We, we need to max them out. You, you ask, I deliver. So let's go and do this. Oh, wait a, wait a minute. There's something coming in and it is Darren with $10 super chat just dropping to say hi. Um, it's not even shown. Just dropping in to say hi and your content is awesome. Keep doing, uh, keep doing, yo. Uh, thank you, Darren, dude. Much appreciated, man. Uh, I, I'm glad to hear that you like it. Um, I'll, I'll give my, let's, let's say it how it is. I always give my best. <laughs> whoa, 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 I forgot something. It's 20, it's one hour has passed. That means live chat is now open for everyone. Hello and welcome, everybody. Live chat on for everyone in the stream chat. Boom. Welcome back. Yeah, first. Yay. Hello. People are coming in like, woo! <laughs> so is it maxed? Yeah, it is. All right. Cool. So now let's test the double Grum. What should we put on these, uh, on these two? Also Grum? I'm not sure. What would make sense? Uh, I, you know, let's go with Squall. Let's just make a quad shotgun setup. That's the type of thing you don't want to have shooting shooting at you. Uh, that is that's the type of thing that kills your robot in three shots or two ro shots. So yeah, next match, and um, yeah, again, Darren, thanks, man, saying hi back to you.
By the way, you see this? That's one of my GoPros um, that I used to use on the Paramotor channel. Um, and I figured out that you can use a GoPro as a webcam. And I might do this. I might put it on a stand where it rotates and then I can provide a second camera perspective for the studio and myself. Uh, but that's still, uh, you know, work in progress. It will take me a little while to make this happen. Um, but, uh, yo, once it is happening, that's gonna be pretty cool. I think. Alright, this guy is coming. So let's go into the beacon and capture it immediately. I hope they don't have a scorpion. Because a scorpion would be able to jump on me now and, uh, ruin my cap. But they didn't. And I have Jack with me! Jack, you're back! Woo! Jack, it's awesome! Alright, so, uh... He's attacking. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna help him. That's how we do it in the Jack Town. That's right. He's got a lot of resistance right now, but he's also still taking a lot of damage. Oh, that's a Hades. Oh, you know what? Oh, come on, man. Another Blitz. I'm in a four-on-one now. I'm now in a four-on-one. That sucks. I saved myself for the moment. But not for a very long time. Yeah, there's nothing. Look, look! The entire enemy team is even running after me and following me everywhere. Meanwhile, you guys have lost the entire map! You guys have lost the entire map! That's how important it was for you guys to get the money gaming down. Yeah, you were great, guys. Great. Five on one. You managed that victory. Good freaking job. And now you lost the match for it. Be in instead of taking care of the beacons and doing what you're supposed to do, they have to get Look Who's Talking Killed. Oh my god, I really should change that name from time to time. <laughs> it's out of control. Whoa, that hawk, dude. Alright, here we go. Brrps. Suppression time. So, now we own all five beacons. How do you like that, team? Was it worth it to lose this match in literally two minutes? Yeah, I guess... I don't know. So he's gonna fall now, and when he does, he's gonna take full damage. See that? That was a new Hawk nerf. He takes full damage upon falling. Okay, now his resistance is down, but I'm suppressed some. Of course I am suppressed. There are six people here. Who's suppressed? It's me. Uh. Alright, let's run in here and get this guy before he gets another ability run. Oh, there is the next ability run here. We can kill him. We can do it. We can do it. Come on. We can do it in his ability. Nope, we couldn't. He lo lost the ability. So yeah, good job, enemy team. Why Why would they waste five guys on, on catching one? Like, hunting down one guy. In a Ravana, most of all. Look, I ended up on the lowest spot on the bottom now. This never happens. Ever. This never happens. But it happened now because they they did not allow me to do anything. They just five on one me. Oh, <laughs> freaking nothing I can do. Speak German, Manny, please. I, I read German donations or something, but I don't want to, you know, just go, uh, go and uh, do complete German sentences out of nowhere because that will mean people don't understand. Like, major majority, 90% of everybody. Aber ein kleiner Satz ist okay. Hier, ja. Bisschen Deutsch gesprochen für dich, okay? <lacht> Grüße raus an dich. Uh, und uh, back to English. So, let's do this again, because that was very unsatisfying. I wanted to run this setup uh, and show you the weaker atomizers now. I think it's 50% less firepower, if I've seen and understand that correctly. Now, last time, last time I did that, I jumped across the entire map. So this time, I'm gonna try and be a little bit more careful. Alright, this was better. See? Now that's how I wanted this last time. Oh my god, he caught me away from the beacon. He caught me before I was touching the beacon. I was literally one meter away from it. I was literally one meter away from the beacon when he hit me. So I wanna I wanna activate double damage here. So that guy. He needs to go. And we can't make him go because it turns out he has a tremendous amount of health. 
But I'm running damage boost rock now, right now, so I'm run rolling in as much as I can. Trying to back off into safety, but it is not possible with this teammate in front of me. So could you just jump on the guy, please? At this point, I haven't yet lost any weapons. Oh my god, it's just not... Is no one going to attack him now? You have full health, man! I'm down to zero health! Why do you not engage him? Why do I have to try and squeeze myself into the tiniest corner to try and somehow stay alive and survive when you have 100% HP? What was the reason behind not engaging him and allowing me to breathe and get myself some health back? I would have regenerated health if I had been a little bit, if gotten a little bit of room. Some people really don't know team play in this game. They're so, some people are so selfish. They don't want to take any point of damage no matter what. Even if it kills a teammate that's right next to you that's at low health and that could otherwise help you tremendously if he was not down, if he was in fact still alive. So, unreal. They just activate your brain sometimes, guys. Seriously. All you needed to do was go in, engage him a little bit, and keep him busy for five seconds. And then we would have both saved the beacon. We lost the beacon because of that very guy. So unfortunate. And I have to say it here because if I don't, people will not learn. People will need to have a little bit of an awareness that there is this is a team game. This is not a one-person game. It's a team game for the love of God. And they need to understand that. It's crazy that they don't. Or so many, at least. All right, going for this guy because he is actually a robot that I can lock down and do a lot of damage against. All right. He's going to do a lot of damage to me now, too. But I am at least... Uh, I stopped his beacon attack. That was worth it, I guess. I couldn't believe my eyes when I saw that this guy has zero... I'm losing a heavy weapon at 40%. No, I'm not losing a light weapon. No, <laughs> no, my... Unreal. All right, whatever. Um, let's try and go for it here. He's gonna have to fly now. Yep, he did it. Trying to land here in safety. Nope, I already got lasered down. All right, um... Yeah, I, I really, I couldn't believe my eyes that this guy was... I thought he was at low health too. Because then it would have made sense that he hides like this, right? Then it would have, you know, fit. When I turned around and saw him at 100% health. Sorry, I kind of lost my crap right there for a second. And rightfully so. Everybody should be upset about this. Just a game, dude. Chill. No, man. People need to learn how to do team play in the game. This is... This is just, you know, it's just wrong. It's just wrong to... to, to... But you know what he was doing? He did not allow me to get into the corner. I couldn't actually uh, get myself in cover because of the dude. I couldn't get in cover because of him. Because he was the one in the corner. I can't do anything here with this robot. I don't have the range. See, and if I had the rocket launchers, now I could splash around the corner and hit him hard. With those shotguns, I can't do anything from here. I have to get close, otherwise I'm not going to make use of this setup. And that's why I wouldn't advise to go with Grom uh, or the shotgun weapons. Uh, they are... You know, they're kind of okay uh, yeah, uh, at, at, you know, 300 meters, but um, they're incredibly horrible at above uh, at 500. You can't do anything with them. And you have no splash damage and, uh, and nothing, right? I can I can just look at him taking out my, my, my teammate pretty much. Yeah, Titan time. So he's got this guy locked, but uh, unfortunately he's still alive. He's shooting over here. I'm trying to kill him. Finally, that worked at least. Okay, see, and he's got he's got a Titan with 500 meters range, so he outranges me. I have 500 meters range also in theory, but not really, because I have to get incredibly close. But now I can do damage. See that? Now I can do really high damage to him. Okay, when he drops his stealth, he's gonna be <laughs> in trouble. Boom. All right. So this is how uh, how this how these web setups work. Okay. 
Trying to get in cover here. Shooting him from a corner, but... Yeah, no chance. But I was able to buy my, my, my team some time. That was okay, right? Alright, so... Jumping into the sniper with a damage boost. Uh, He's locked, okay. Let's do added damage to him. And if he drops me down to overdrive, then I will do even le even more damage to him. But now he's suppressed and locked. Is he reloading his laser? I think he might be reloading or he was reloading the laser weapon. Yep. Alright, so my overdrive is now ready. And I can suppress him again. Oh man, he's taking 300% damage right now and he didn't even hold up his shield. Which is weird. Okay, he's got the shotguns on that setup. It's a very well leveled Arthur too. Yeah, I can't really do anything about this guy. I can, however, lock him. Yeah, I got him locked now. Problem is, he's probably gonna uh, kill me with his with his blast wave ability. Actually, wait. As long as I have a shield, I don't think he can blast wave me, right? Yep. As long as I have shield, he can't deal damage to me with a blast wave. See, I'm getting the shield back up. And when he does the blast wave now, I'm not taking damage. See that? That's a unique feature from, uh, from the setup here. From the Typhon. The Typhon has a unique shield that even uh, 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 protects him from the sh uh, from the suppression of the Nodens from e and even from the blast wave of the Arthur. You're, you're protected from this as long as the shield is up. Anime Freak uh, Life 3. Großer Fan von dir, Manny. Drei Jahre, stark. <laughs> Vielen Dank, man. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, Ignar Juk again. Five dollar, uh, five euro super chat. Ignar Juk in German. Um, I hate a, uh, I hate a lot fast shell with sonic weapons. By the way, copy my hangar, play it, show your skills. Ignar Juk, just so much. There's something coming for you, okay? There's something coming for you. It's it's already made. It's just not released yet, all right? So, uh, just have a bit of patience. Something special is gonna come for you personally with your donation last time and your idea. I took it, I made it, and it's gonna happen. Uh, and uh, Finn vs. Steak, again, uh, with 2.3 uh, euros. Try Hawk plus, plus jump with the ability and the fast jump. With the first ability and then fast jump. Um, I need to probably maybe change the setup, though. Okay, let's put a uh, jump unit on it. That means we do get um, added damage boost. But I think we need different weapons for this. Uh, let's go with uh, with something different. Uh, that we, we haven't run yet. Uh, what could it be? Um, you know what? Let's go with Punishers. Yeah. They have 500 meters range. They do a lot of damage. Actually, if they like unload the whole clip. Where is the Punisher? Uh, Avenger. I was looking for Avenger in this case, sorry. Uh, there it is. Let's go with, yeah, that's, actually, I'm really, I really want to do this. I'm like, I saw this and I'm immediately motivated, motivated. So let's go do this with, uh, overdrive and 300% weapon damage, okay? Doing overdrive, uh, team deathmatch now. So people tell me to, to relax and ch chill in the stream chat. All right, you guys want me to chill, I'll chill. You know, I just, I, I just sometimes wish there was more team play, you know? I just sometimes wish... People would be a little bit more aware of their surroundings and what other, you know, teammates of them have. If I am at maximum health and there's somebody with like 5%, then I try to shield him. I try to keep him in the game, you know? Um, and, uh, but I guess I can't expect that from everybody. So you guys are right. Chill is their name of the game. Uh, wow, team deathmatch really takes a bit of a time. Money, money, money. Uh, you rule, money. Thank you, Carlos. No. Uh, Carl? Carl Rios. Carl Rios. Uh, my, uh, my, my font is too small here. I can barely read it. Hornet Magnetar from Venix. Venix made a comment and wants to see Hornet Magnetar. I made a test server video. I don't have it yet. I don't yet have Hornet and Magnetar, uh, on, 
uh, on the uh, on the uh, on the te uh, battle rack account. So here it is, 500 meters range, lots of bullets, okay, and double damage with the drone activation and triple damage with overdrive. So, what does he have? Is that? I think it's a sniper weapon, isn't it? And this is vortex. Is that a vortex setup? No. Yes. I don't know. Oh, it's shock train. I couldn't identify the, uh... Yeah, that was Vortex, okay. I took the hit, that's okay. Uh, I, I like people using Vortex anyways, so that's... Boom, back in safety here. Alright. Let's go and jump forward. And doing double damage. That was a nice hit there, Haichi. Nice hit. You timed it well with my arrival. Alright, starting to fly now. And we're only doing, remember, we're only doing half the damage now to enemy robots. We're no longer... Oh. Who, wait, who was supposed to catch this one? Where did that go? What the heck? He must have made a targeting mistake, but uh, glad to see a Haichi or somebody even playing uh, uh, Vortex. You know when the last time was when I saw a Vortex setup? That's right, never. Um, so, doing double damage here with the over uh, Punishers, at least for a few seconds. The Haichi is still in the game. Double damage activated here. Alright, there we go. Taking him down to low health. And then trying to land in safety. Uh, that mad high jump is something you can only do uh, when you have the jump unit on the Hawk. Uh, somebody else was firing Vortex or Aphid. And that was not him because he just fired now. Ah, this guy. The Haichi has a uh, phase shift. And you've seen it, he, uses, he activates phase shift every single time. Uh, when he, uh... Double damage rolling. His face shift is now used, and now it's time to die, dude. No, I can't catch him, man! I can't get catch this guy! I can't catch him. The, the dashes, the dashes saved him so much! Reaper, you're the man! Your playstyle just saved you. Seriously, I was using... What I just did was using all my skills. And you dodged that. You dodged that, man. Props to you, man. That was... That was brutal. You dodged this by keeping all your dashes ready. Keeping your face, face shift. Waiting it out. Doing the right timing. Never missing a, a dash. Like, not making a dash mistake of getting stuck at the corner. That was perfect. Reaper, that was god-level play right there, my friend. Seriously. Props to you, man. That was amazing. Alright, he's got suppressed. And I'm doing a lot of damage to him now. Finishing him off. Good. Uh, you know, you gotta, you gotta give respect where respect is due, right? Uh, you gotta do it. When people play this amazing, they gotta, they gotta earn some respect for this. And that was a very, very great playstyle from him. Fin finishing this guy. Here we go. Nice. I like that. I like that this guy is playing Vortex, and not just playing Vortex, he's playing it well. Like, he knows how to play Vortex and his Haichi. You can tell he's not playing this for fun just a second, just for a few matches. He learned how to play that setup, right? He's gotten good at it. And that was really awesome. Awesome to see that. Okay. How are you not dead yet? Am I suppressed? Why did I do such so little damage to him? That was weird. I should have done way more. Alright, I'm pretty sure he's gonna respawn here. Yep, he does. Let's see how much damage this normally does. That was weird that I did so little damage before. What was that robot? It's an... Oh, okay, it's an Auchun. Oh, I almost managed to kill him before he started flying. I almost managed to do it. But sadly, all almost isn't good enough. Uh, okay. 
Uh oh, another Titan. And again, every time something hits me, another weapon loses my robot. <laughs> every single time I take one hit, another another one of my weapon kisses goodbye. Again, now I only have one. Every time I get hit, no wait, okay, I have two. Sorry. <laughs> but this is like typical that I like. If I lose uh, reach low HP, I almost never really still have all four weapons. That doesn't exist. How do I get the, the shotgun uh, Titan in sh short range now? On Beacon Rush, I know how to get in short range because I can simply spawn on them, but on, uh, on this here, it's a lot more difficult. Okay, I, I think this is also a Titan. And I think it's not just a Titan, I think it is a uh, Ao Ming. So I'm staying in my walking state for now and just double- Wow! Look how fast he goes down, man. Oh, hello. Oh, man. I can do some heavy damage, but of course, as soon as I fly, the entire map shoots me. Uh, I can never do any action without getting instantly outfocused out of the game, dude. Okay, healing up. Come on, drop that. Boom. Boom. Those shotguns do a ton of damage, man. Seriously. They do so much damage. Unreal. And they keep me at range, and I can't use those shotguns very effectively here. Boom, boom. Hey, man, even at 300 meters, the damage output actually seems to be pretty decent. Alright, let's squish this thing. Now, he's making sure never to get in line of sight with me. I mean, seriously, you could tell. He was literally getting... He really accepted to get killed by someone else. As long as it's not me who gets the kill somehow. I don't know. Uh-oh. Let's land here for a bit. Because I'm actually safe here. And I can sh corner shoot, uh, or basically roof shoot this guy. He's gonna reload now every uh, any second. Now I think he needs to reload in two seconds. That gives me time to flatten him real quick. And then finish him. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, this is firepower. This is the definition of firepower, dude. Unreal. That is insane. Oh, hey, there's an Ares. I didn't even see that guy. Okay. Oh, it's Reaper again. Boom. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. All right, so I guess... Yeah, at this range, against such a small target, we're not really doing any damage here. That's very little damage. Uh, but is it, if the target is a Titan, you can still do a, a, a decent amount, I think, at that range. He's corner shooting. But now he's getting attacked from behind. Nothing he can do. He gets completely out outperformed by everybody. Like, uh, everybody's around him. So, uh, I'm hoping you guys are uh, happy with, uh, with this um, update. Uh, although it's not perfect, I think the Havoc Scatter and Devastator should be on there too. Uh, but uh, in the grand majority, like, pretty much most of the things they did were right. In my opinion, were right. And needed to be done. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, man. That's not even... That's, that's just unreal. There could be one more robot in the game. 36 is the maximum amount of enemy robots that can be in a match. Fire Barrage, yeah. But let's swap back to uh, the, sh the the rocket launchers, okay? Because, in my opinion, those are the better the better set of weapons because they're more universal. You can still dish out a lot of damage, not as fast in short range as the shotguns, of course, but you can still dish out a ton of damage, and that very quickly you never have a long reload for these SARS. And you can most importantly do that around corner with splash damage and you can hit people that are, you know, um, that are at 500 meters and 400 meters very hard. That you could otherwise not really with the shotguns. 
Agreed. Fernando Arnendo, uh, 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 no, Arendonto. I think he also he means the, the the update that he also agrees that most of the things in the update were really good. Uh, really, I think they nailed it. That was a very great update. Uh, what happened in a new update? I just joined the stream. Well, since we're loading into the game anyways, let me just show show you. You can you can stop the stream here, and take a look at those little buffs and uh, and things. Then we have Inquisitor buff, movement speed and ability cooldown, Mender buff, Nemesis buff, Shredder nerf, Quant uh, Atomizer, Nucleo and Quarker nerf, less damage, Scorpion nerf, less resistance and shorter ability, Nightingale buff for healing, nerf for fighting, uh, capturing, and Hawk is a massive nerf um, when it comes to any kind of combat. Because uh, the Hawk really lost uh, the... Uh, let's go with this. The Hawk lost the ability to get a resistance as soon as he presses the button. Now he gets the resistance only uh, if he reaches his highest altitude point and loses it like the Aochun immediately at the beginning. Of course. I love how they just walk out with the shield already running. It's like... Every time. Ugh. So I have two guys on the other side there. I got him locked and he just had his shield so... That's it for him now. That instant lockdown really broke his neck right there, man. He could spawn there. I gotta be careful. He could literally spawn right in front of me. And of course, instant ability. Dude, I never, I never make it. I never make it before they activate there. It's literally a thing that I cannot do. It's just not possible. Whoa, the damage he just took. Jeez. That was crazy. Uh, okay, where are these, these guys spawning in? Only half the weapons were able to fire. He's corner shooting only. No point for me in attacking him at this point. Not like this. I need a Malji to come out. Alright, he should have not caught my attention here. Boom, boom, boom. Wow, he gets killed so quick. Dude! That was with double damage, that's why. And of course there goes his ability. Alright, uh... Man, I'm a bit of a, a bit of a problem situation now. But I want Overdrive to activate, so... I'm gonna delete him with the double damage now. Let's first get the, uh, the, the the guy in the distance. Because he would otherwise activate his ability again. Okay, here's someone. Oh my god, what is this playstyle? He probably re re repair reloads his ability. Yeah, he, now he's coming. You know, we can still kill you. That little bit of health is not that, that problematic. Uh, what is that guy? Oh, it's a scorpion. It's a scorpion, isn't it? Yep. It's a scorpion, all right. Double damage activated, but I can't finish him off because he teleported away. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Down to last stand instantly. Wow. That's a friendly. Okay. He's going to jump on us any moment now again. There it is. I'm going to be try and be ready for it. Boom, boom, boom. Got him. Double damage activated here against him. Ah, oh, one more shot. Nice. And we're still alive. Triple damage now, by the way. Overdrive is now rocking. Uh, apparently I didn't hit him with my ability. Uh-oh. That's a problem. That's a problem, and he is really, really following us here everywhere. But I got his ability now deactivated. And we're triple, triple attacking him right now. Yeah, he really wanted me, man. He really wanted me, dude. And I got the kill again, PL. Come on, as, as often as you want, man. I got you covered. As, long, as soon as you spawn in. Except it's an Arthur. An Arthur would suck. That would be a problem. All right, let's walk all the way over here. I don't know what they have. Oh, there's a target. Mm. 
No. Oh my god, again! I got him with the ability, but I couldn't get him before he activates his thing. Did you see that again? It's unreal, but it actually did happen again. Oh, it's him again. It's the PL guy. It's the PL guy again, and he finally made it! After four attempts. And, and not just four attempts. After four attempts of killing me and focusing me and me and only. And waiting for the moment to spawn. Did you notice that he was not spawning into the game? He was waiting for me to be busy and to have my focus on someone else. Only then would he respawn, start his attack, and fly at me. Only then, only after he was 100% certain he does not get attacked by me. Only then. Because he needed that win after four attempts, man. And he got it. So with this much pers perseverance, I guess you deserve that win eventually. So why am I doing no damage to him? Oh, because I'm suppressed. Okay, that would explain it, yeah. That would explain it. Uh, I didn't see that I was suppressed. That was a, a bit of a surprise. Alright, so let's wait for our ability. The man, the myth, the legend, yes. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, come on, man. I'm, I'm trying to take cover here. This is me seeking cover. Ah, this sucks. Alright, teleporting back. That was me seeking cover in the corner, and he spawns right behind me. So, any, anything in front of me here? No? Oh, we have more donations here. Ignar Juk again, uh, with 10 euros. Yay, great, thanks. I hope you had fun recording the video. Skill versus meta, you the return. Keep your, uh, keep doing your amazing videos and stay calm. No more many rage mode. Uh, well, a little bit, you know, come on. A little bit of, of getting, you know, annoyed by stuff is okay. But I guess I should not, you know, enter rage mode as much, yeah. But that was a very worthless teleport. Bop, bop. But this thing now has 30% uh, resistance only. It no longer has 50%. So a big change on the Scorpion, right? Uh, we have uh, 10 SEK from Janstar Star Sayad Mohammad. Hey man, thank you, sir. He didn't even write a message. He just sent sent a a, a dono bomb. Thank you, sir. All right, let's go and do a round free fall. Let's try free fall once, okay? Not sure if we have the right weapon setups for it, but um, let's do it anyways. We do have good robots. Um, not all the weapons are the best right now, I guess. But uh, let's see. The Shredder with um, um, well, the Blitz is pretty strong. I guess we're going to start with that. Shredder Blitz. Here we go. Let's see how this does. Is that an... Uh, I think this might be a Ravana. I'm not sure if I can... If I see it right. No, it's an Ares, actually. Oh, man. Really? And he freaking locked me down so I couldn't walk into the shield. Oh, what? He got that kill? How? How did he... What? I was in the Ares shield to get that kill. I was in the Ares shield to get the kill, and I somehow didn't get the kill. Unreal. No, I have to reload now. What? This is insane. What a crazy beginning is this? This is the most crazy beginning for a man. <laughs> that was insane. The game is trolling me so hard, man. Come on, activate my overdrive. My fir no, my second kill. That was my second kill. I think I killed four people just to get one kill. How did that work? How is that even possible? He's locked. That's why he can't move uh, out of this. Where are you looking? And he didn't take damage there at the at first. I think that was a bit of a lag too. That was you know the beginning of this match is legendary. This is <laughs> how did he steal the kill? The Ares had a shield going. That was a pretty safe bet that I get the kill. There was like nothing that could go wrong. And of course it somehow goes wrong and he gets the kill. I can't believe it. No, actually, people, that, that's not a rage. That's not a Manny rage right now. That's actually me being incredibly happy and like joyful actually even. That was because it's like, it's such a rare thing that just happened there. 
I think that's like a unicorn turned inside out that we have just seen. <laughs> that, was, that was not normal. But now you see, this is how it should have looked from the beginning. Because this setup is still powerful. And that's what I wanted to show, that the, that the shredders are still beastie. So what are you guys doing over there? Are you even attacking each other? Nobody is even taking damage. What is going on? Alright, let's try and suppress them both and steal the kill. I was able to steal the kill because I suppressed him. Now let's try and run into the shield. There we go. Living legend. That was easy this time. Well, that was easy, yeah. Right from the beginning it was easy, right? Oh, dang it. I could have focused the other guy first. Then I would have gotten both kills. <laughs> what an insane beginning that match was. Oh, you know what he has? He's got a... Uh, over uh, uh, the uh, the thing. Okay, I have to reload anyhow. He's got uh, anti-control. He also has the same setup as I do. Uh, but he's got last stand and I don't. Oh, come on! Okay, I can do that too. Here. Now we're both suppressed. What do you like? How do you like this now? Die finally! Jesus, he's not going down! Why? He's got healing. Yeah, that was my living legend streak. He just broke it because it took me forever to kill this guy. Ah. Money, you're the best YouTuber ever. Have a nice day, man. Art guy, thank you so much, buddy. Hey, man. Uh, is he using his ability? Well, I guess he should have used his ability. Hello, hockey boy. How are you, man? Oh, he got qu oh he got both things. I got him down to last stand though, which was awesome. Now I'm baiting. Aha! No, you're dead, dude. You're dead. There's nothing you can do about it. That's it. I completely baited him into another. He had anti-control and stealth unit. He had both things that basically are meant to break me. All right. Boom. Boom. And he face shifts again because he doesn't want to be suppressed the whole time. And now he's suppressed again because those web Again, look. He keeps getting suppressed the entire time. There's never a time where he can deal damage to me because I have the suppression drone. And every time he fires, he gets immediately suppressed. Now I locked him and baited his flight. I'm still in the game. I can't believe it. Whoa. Another one is coming around the corner. Oh, he's dropping his last stand. That's awesome. Let me suppress the guy, so I can get... Yo. Okay, you are suppressed and yet you take my kill. Of course. Oh, what? The last stand wasn't active. Uh, I thought I dropped his last stand before. Uh-oh, next guy. Next guy is coming. Boom. Boom. Again with... Um, with anti-control. Uh-oh. Ah! Uh, of course. Ah. Okay, you know what? Let's uh, let's get a, let's give him the kill. All right. Let's give him the kill. Keep doing what you're doing. Thank you guys. Why are people so nice to me in the stream chat? I'm getting such awesome comments of people saying I'm awesome. I'm making cool streams and such. Yo, guys, I really appreciate that you're saying this. Um. And let's just rain the rockets on the Arthur, because that's what we do best here. Okay. Then this guy. Got him as he's trying to land. Now he's getting stuck at the wall. Boom, there goes the last end. And boom, there goes the rest. And boom, there goes him. Activating his flight. Actually, no. Now he's activating the flight. Okay. The reload on those Tsars is so fast. It's unreal. Boom. <laughs> oh, man. This is so insane. I love those rockets, man. Those lock rockets with the big boom. They're just the best. Oh, hello. Okay, I was unable to hit him. Oh, that's actually a Fenrir. I didn't know they had a Fenrir. Okay, I will have to jump and fly down, back in cover. 
Oh, that's not where I'm gonna work when I'm getting locked. Oh my god, that is the worst thing that could have happened. A lockdown at this particular moment is disastrous for me here. That was a disaster. How did- Whoa, 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 my rockets just didn't hit. Did you see that? Again? What? Oh, okay, now. I'm hitting him very accurately there. Haha, he shielded. He brought up that shield. Both guys did, by the way. Both guys brought up the shield. Why is he taking so little? I don't understand. It's a freaking high Hades. It's not supposed to take. He's not taking any damage. What is this? You see this, right? I'm not crazy. This guy is not. He cannot take damage. Now he's taking damage again. But if I use the big rockets. Uh, if I use the, the small rockets, I can't deal any damage to him at all. Like zero. What what is what is wrong with this game? It was impossible to deal damage. Completely impossible. Even with double rockets and the small rockets. Boom 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 boom. His shield is up or his shield is down. Takes zero damage the guy. See, also still he's still taking no damage. Or almost no damage. Yeah, he activates the shield and yet you get the kill. Yo, this 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 guy was bucked. I don't know what he had going, but that was not normal, man. That was not normal. Uh, Syed Muhammad again with 20 SEK. You're the best. <laughs> Love you from Afghanistan. Hey, man. Thank you and greetings to Afghanistan, dude. So let's do uh, double damage right here. There we go. We're breaking through his physical shield super quickly with those punishers. We're starting to fly. We're dead before we reach altitude. We're dead before we reach altitude. Unreal. And this, even though we already had altitude, we were already in the air. We already had the altitude, but we were losing. Uh, we, you have to reach the highest point after that thing. So we're gonna lose this battle now, obviously, because this is a Titan. I don't understand how his shield is still there, by the way, right? I don't get it, because, let's face it, we hit him with a kajillion amount of bullets before, and that should have dropped his shield. But somehow it didn't. The shield is still there, but he's... Yeah, right now he's not using the shield. Obviously he was gonna do that. That was clear. I think if you stand so close to him, then he can't hit you with the, with the machine guns. If you pummel him like that, it's very hard for him to hit you. Uh, Javid with 50 SEK Super Chat. How is your new place? It's awesome, man. I love it. I'll be showing you a studio tour, uh, making a studio tour very soon, okay? Just uh, stay ready for it. It's gonna come. It's gonna happen. Vahid uh, Shatkan. Hey, man, you guys are all like from uh, from the Middle East, huh? I can't tell by the names. Like, it's all uh, names from what, what I would picture are somewhere from the Middle East. Hey, Manny, in my opinion, you're the best in the game. Keep going. I love you, buddy. Well, uh, thank you. Thank you so much. That's uh, your opinion. You're entitled to your opinion, and thank you so much, man. Appreciate it. Uh, we did win the free fall match rather easily with that uh, Shredder thing. It's crazy, but that thing is just insanely powerful. Let's go with one match beacon rush. Alright, so, arc guy, I've said that, I think. Yep, I said this, I said this. Yeah, I think I said it all. So, let's go with a sniper setup with triple damage, hopefully. Whoa. The match is already advanced. 40 seconds into the match, look. Alright, let's try and get into 600 meters range against this guy. Because we have uh, the sniping weapons. He's coming in closer. For an ins inspection. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's got it. He's got the thing. We can now deactivate his ability. He cannot fly now. And that's why he dies. He couldn't activate his flight ability. So I was able to easily out-snipe him in this case. Pew! I got him. Activating double damage for the moment. 
but I'm low on ammo right now. That's a bit of a problem. Okay. Okay, I almost killed this dude too. Um, so sniping on this map is a real pleasure, guys. It is a real pleasure to be sniping on a map like this. Seriously. There's an, an a leech is coming up. And of course he managed to activate his leech ability right before um, before I hit him with the ability charge. Of course he did. Of course. Of course he did. What else is new? Again, I never get to actually hit someone's ability before, except for the hawk right there. That hawk I was able to hit. He is still supposed to be protected? Did you see that, man? I saw 70% of his robot sticking out of the wall, and the game considered him protected against from the wall. Wow, game. <laughs> wow. Scroll back and see what I, t I was talking about, guys. That is completely ridiculous. Okay, this guy is locked. Double damage is rolling. Uh-oh. Now that is a bit annoying. But you know what? I think we can handle him. What? I didn't get the kill? You know what? Let's get the beacon here. So he can't fly. I should be able to kill him before he gets into altitude. And, uh, nope, I can't. And we have somebody behind us, too. That's a problem. Of course he activates the shield before I get him with the ability. My god, is the Typhon even working in the game? Like, seriously, what stops people from simply activating their ability right before uh, you activate uh, deactivate theirs, right? What stops them from doing that? Nothing! Ah! Uh, he activated his flight. Whoa, why am I hitting through his shield? Did you see that? Dude, I was able to hit through his shield. Somehow, I don't know why. The game allowed me to hit right through his shields. Yeah, I, I, you know, guys, I'm occupying the, so many of their team. I'm occupying so many guys. All you've got to do is just use that time to capture some beacon somewhere on the map. He's coming in with the explosion. I'm trying to cap. Not possible at this point. He's again doing the explosion run. Got him. Now I can kill him all the way. This time I did get him with before he could use his ability. Oh man, I'm doing a lot of damage, but... Oh wait, it's a hawk. I locked him. If I stay underneath him, then he can't hit me. Ah! No! All right, man, seriously, with this amount of effort that I put into, into this, I mean, you know, my team should have really, really won this match in the meantime. Like, come on, guys. How did you not... How did you not uh, take the beacons in the meantime? Okay. I'm doing more damage to him than he does to me, I believe. But the thing, of course, is I have two titans shooting me. We're, uh, and I'm losing both heavy weapons. <laughs> it's unreal, dude. It's unreal. This game. All right, jumping in with uh, Punish uh, Avengers and Punishers. I'm not flying as long as I don't have to. All right, now, now they're finally taking beacons. That's good. Oh no, he got this one back. Let's try and break through the- Oh, I have to fly. Otherwise, I'm gonna take too much damage here. Taking down this dude. Landing in safety for the moment. He's getting down to last stand, which is awesome. 
Physical shield going down. Nice. I think I can capture the beacon from here. Maybe we still have a chance. How did you still sp- Oh, come on, man. How did he still spawn here? Seriously. That is so stupid. He should not have been able to spawn here anymore. The, the beacon was already white. The <laughs> game allows him to spawn here. Unreal. So, machine guns are ready for you, man. Here we go. Whoa, they still have a hawk right there. Flying over them to try and make them lose their lock. Ah, uh, getting the hawk first. Or this guy, maybe? Oh, man, I don't know who to attack first. They have so many people still left, it's unreal. Punishers are on you. But I won't be able to kill him because he's got the uh, the thing. How do, how do we not yet win the match? I don't understand. We have so much more power right now. But they keep spawning like bosses on that beacon. You see this beacon is being spawned on so hard. It's being spawned on so hard. Endless spawning on that beacon. <laughs> but now he's going down. Wow, you have three abilities left. He had three abilities left at this late in the battle. Wow. All right, so I think I guess we did make it. We did beat them. Uh, but oh, that was a that was a t tough one. And you know what? I occupied three half of the enemy team here on the beacon side. So I expected my team to easily push the rest of the beacons in the meantime, but that was uh, apparently not so easy. All right, so what else do we have? Boo uh, Ardias, Ardi, no, uh, Beo Ardus, Ardis, I think, uh, became a member. Thank you, man, for joining in. Logan, why not? Why not? <laughs> like dreadnought. Um, with a ten dollar super chat. Thank you, man. And uh, ja ja Javi, no, Javid is. I think you call it uh, Javid, or is that? No, so he says he's Russian. He says he's Russian. If, when he's Russian, then I don't. I, I don't think you say Javid, right? Javid is when you're, like, Spanish. So, um, yeah, this was the live stream for tonight, ladies and gents. I hope you guys had some crazy fun. I did. I did have two or bad, ma bad, uh, bad critical moments, but uh, the rest was pretty good. And uh, I was able to hopefully show you a bit of the updated um, 6.0 update. Keep in mind, we're going to see more of it now. I will be making Demeter videos. I will be making uh, maxed... Uh, mar mar uh, Magnetar and uh, Hornet videos. So all this stuff is gonna come out, okay? So stay tuned for that. Hopefully you had some fun. Thanks for watching. Uh, bro, you won, you thought you lost. No, 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 I won. I I, I, did, I, said, I I thought we might lose in the middle of the match. I thought we might lose it. Yeah, but we did win in the end, yeah. That's right. Or did I say I lost? Uh, Hawk is a joke, somebody said. No, I think the Hawk is powerful still. Uh, it's j It just doesn't delete you anymore immediately, right? It just, it really like, the laser beam is now a supplement to the actual firepower on the robot itself. The laser beam is no longer your maximum firepower. That's the three heavy weapons or even more. Two heavy weapons and two light weapons equal more than three heavy weapons. So that's your firepower right there. More than any other robot you see on the battlefield normally, except maybe Typhon or something. Uh, or of course Fury Behemoth or stuff like this. Um, but uh, that's your firepower. And then you have a supplemental firepower during resistance with the laser beam. Uh, that's crazy. Like, the Hawk is incredibly powerful still, and it was the, the right thing to do. I stand by that. What they did, they nailed it. It was right, the right thing to do with the Hawk. And the same goes with the Scorpion. It was way too crazy. Uh, and, um, yeah, I, I like this. So, just my opinion. You can agree uh, or disagree. We can agree to disagree, but that's how I see it. Uh, bye, Manny. Good stream, Damon. Da da uh, Damon says, uh, "What was his name?" Uh, Damien Vargas. Yeah. Thank you, man. So, I uh, hope you guys all have a great day, night, whatever it is for you. We'll see each other in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. And uh, again, thanks for joining into the stream. Thanks for contributing. Thanks for becoming a member. All this helps a lot. Uh, but um, you guys just tuning in every day is really just the, is is the aw most awesome thing uh, uh, there is. So. See you guys in the next one, and uh, don't forget to join our Discord, right? There it is. Uh, I still am in the process of putting up stuff in my new apartment and setting up, and I'm a lot of, uh, working a lot right now, so 
I'll be taking a break now, but you guys should join that Discord because it's like uh, 10,000 people now all on it, all War Robots players and people playing clans, finding clans, playing matches. It's really awesome. So you find a link to the Discord in the group chat, uh, in the video description. And uh, yeah, so see you next time. Money signing off. Bye bye. <laughs> Look at that sad hawk. <laughs> I love this picture.